So in terms of integration strategies, we've got three. So forward integration, uh, when two businesses combine to take over distributors, and this involves the expansion of business activities to gain control over the distribution of products, right? That's going forward. But if we were to go back, this is when two businesses combine to take over suppliers. And this aims to decrease the business's dependency on the supplier. That's really important. We don't ever want to depend on suppliers, you know, so, so, so heavily. We need backup options or we need to exercise control or we're just looking for, well, lower prices. So that's forward integration, backward integration. And in terms of horizontal integration, this is when a business takes control of or incorporates other businesses in the same industry which produce or sell the same goods and services. And ultimately, the aim is to reduce the threat of competition or substitute products and services. So look, if I were to explain it here, right, this is our business, right? If we go forward, we merge with distributors. If we go backwards, we merge with suppliers. So we reduce dependency on distributors if we go forward. So that's the distribution of our products. If we go back, we reduce our dependency on suppliers. Maybe just try and like almost monopolize that supplier so we get consistently like cheaper goods. We can improve the supplier so we can reduce their production costs. Or horizontally, we can integrate as well. And this is to reduce competition. That's really big. And, you know, this is where alliances or strategic alliances come into place as well. We take control or we incorporate other businesses. So we become the holding company. They become the subsidiary. We operate in the same industry. We join business operations. Maybe we just put them under the same company or they can maintain their identity, you know, so they we can still like differentiate between the two companies, you know, if we were the consumer. Um, and yeah, we're reducing competition. We're also eliminating the threat of substitute products and services. And in turn, we're increasing our market share by taking over their market share, selling the same products and getting their profit. But, you know, in turn, we'd have to forcibly take control over the company. Well, not forcibly, but legally. Uh, and just buy some shares or appoint uh, some of our directors as part of their company and exercise direct or indirect control. So those are the three parts of integration, uh, FBH, and these are the integration strategies. Small diagram here. And yeah, not too difficult to understand.